Unlike my husband, Clever, I watch after our guests. What was that you said, venomous wife? Don't mind the yelling. My parents are always going at each other. Frobby, a customer needs a drink. Too lazy to give him a drink yourself? Oh. You want a drink? I should remind Clever to clean this place up. <clears throat> I'm what you'd call a soldier of fortune. Make me an offer, and I just might fight at your side. Fancy robes. You a wizard or something? Can't be too careful these days, with the war and other dangers. For a fair price, I'll watch your back. That's a fair price. My blade is yours. You leave. I'll follow. My father, Klepper, is the one you want to talk to. I just clean up. This is the Silver Blood Inn. I'll let you figure out who owns it by yourself. If I can't get you something, I'm sure my wife will bellow at me until I can. Here, take a look at this. Some of the Jarl's men came by and left this bounty letter. Remember, ale is cheaper than blood in Markar. A man like me makes a lot of enemies. People are always trying to cheat me. Hey, you. Yeah, you. Fresh meat for your stomach? Now here's a man I'm glad to see. I got some wonderful jewelry. Come back if you need a new ring or necklace. I said alms, you backbiter. Give a crippled worker a helping hand. How about a septum? Finally. Now get lost. Bring more gold next time. The finest jewelry in all of Markar. Yes. Excuse me, but do you know anything about this house? Seen anyone enter or leave? Thank you for your time. Heard they're reforming the Dawn Guard, vampire. have to fight them here. They live here too, my yard. That's what I'm telling you. Treat my people fairly, and I will do the same to you. I'm impressed. Forsworn usually makes short work of mercenaries, but you took care of them. Here is your reward. It all started here, this rebellion. When the Empire lost the Reach during the Great War, we became desperate. We promised a group of Nord militia free worship in exchange for their help retaking the Horde. Then the Elves found out about it. 
We were forced to arrest all of them. Ulfric Stormcloak, their leader, used the whole thing as proof that the Empire had abandoned Skyrim. The rebels called it the Markarth Incident. It was the founding day for the Stormcloaks, and where this war really started. I do. A personal matter. My father died trying to negotiate with the Force One, back when that was possible. They took his shield to those Hargraven beasts they consort with. I need you to bring it home where it belongs. I warn you, it's dangerous work. No man of mine has ever faced a Hargraven and lived. I'll understand if you decline. Divines watch over you. The White Gold Concordant, our treaty with the Elves after the Great War, forbids free worship of Talos. But that's what we promised Ulfric and his men. It seems foolish looking back, but at the time we were hoping the Elves wouldn't find out. Don't get too far ahead. So when they did find out, it was either we arrest Ulfric and the militia, or enter into yet another war with the Aldmeri Dominion. The choice was clear, and now Ulfric threatens the thinly veiled peace we sacrificed so much for. Retrieve that shield at all costs. They say if a vampire so much as scratches you, you'll turn into one. That better not be true. Good to see Skyrim still has such fine people. You, I have things to study. What is it? Take a look. Oh, goodbye. Got to thinking. Maybe I'm the Dragonborn. I just don't know it yet. <laughs> 